Hello everyone, um, I am Dre Almeida, I am a Kern developer from Igalia. Uh, I mostly know for my Futex work, but right now we're on the graphics uh, side that people say that is the cool side, so let's see. So today I want to talk about something very simple that is how to flip your frames, your page asynchronous on DRM uh, Atomic API. So you probably know that, but uh, basically a recap. So between the vblanks, you are you hinder your scene, and then you ask for a page flip, and then when vblank comes comes in, uh, this new page is presented to on the display. But what it, what it happens if you miss it, this vblank by just a uh, small uh, just as uh, small seconds. So this uh, page will not be presented anymore, right? Because you missed the vblank and you don't want you to have tiering and so on. But you kind of wasted your time uh, rendering this frame, right? Because it's not be presented because uh, the next page flip will overwrite this one. So here is what uh, we're coming the async page flip. So you just say well, whatever, present right now, uh, regardless of heavy tiering or any artifact, just present it. And, uh, and why do we do that? Uh, because, I mean, it's as all, all the other developers here, we, are, we want more frames hate in our games, right? So yeah, this will get us some more uh, one or two frames per second, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, that's why we want to do that. So um, we, we can do that, this async page flip on the legacy DRM API. You just need to use this flag on the supported drivers, of course, and we have a bunch of drivers that, that can do that. And uh, um, But on the Atomic DRM API, we couldn't do that so far. You, you get the uh, error if you try to do that. And so this was like my first task on the graphics side and was like, wow, how can I do that? Seems very complex. So I went all over the DRM code, learn about uh, frame buffers, about uh, gen, about memories, and so on. But uh, so th that was my, my quest to, to implement that. But I noticed a very funny thing when I was studying. That is, um, when you use the legacy DRM API at AMD GPU, I was saw, uh, saw a lot of calls to the Atomic uh, DRM, and I was a little bit confused, but uh, it turns out that when you call a legacy DRM Ayokoto, uh, the AMD GPU will translate that to Atomic internally. So I was like, well, it's just a matter of uh, join things, because if your driver internally converts legacy thing to atomic and if you support uh, a sync flip on the legacy side i mean the work is almost done right is you you can do legacy flip atomically but the drive the user space don't uh, doesn't know that so i figured that out and i mean it was just a matter of uh wiring something up and simon is helping upstreaming that so yeah, basically all the work was done. So it was very surprisingly, but at, at least I learned a lot of, about DRM in the way. So basically we can do that on Atomic. You just need to set some states and the AMD GPU driver is ready to do that, to uh, do the sync flip. And also we now we have a new uh, capability at DRM. That is this thing that Atomic async page flip and uh, this needs to be different from the old async capability because uh, not all drivers are in this situation. So, uh, and also we, we figured some stuff out that is um, the DRM should reject any other change because it seems that you can't async flip and change other things of the, the, the frame buffer. So um, it seems that the, the hardware can do that. Uh, when it's doing a sync flip and just work on the primary plane. I think this is another hardware limitation. And also uh, we found out uh, something interesting on AMD GPU that if you try to do a sync flip 
while change some properties of your frame, uh, AMG GPU will just uh, degrade it to being uh, sync. And but this is not a, a, a right uh, users from the user space point of view. That is that is not right. So we patch it to. Um, uh, how can I say to, to deny that? To if you try to to do that async and with any other change, the AMG GPU will just say no. And I don't know. I hope that we didn't um, break any user space doing that. Let's see. And what is done? So we have a basic IGT test for that um, that use the old uh, IGT KMS sync flip. Uh, on AMG GPU, we, we have a patch on the middle list which for, for merger. Uh, the Intel driver uh, is on the same situation that I showed before. Uh, they, they translate all legacy things to Atomic and they support a, a sync flip on the legacy API. So it's kind of uh, the same thing. I just uh, trying to run more tests, but I think it should be very easy to support as well. Uh, so here is the, the patch that Simon sent on the mail list, if you want to have a look. And what is next? So Wayland, right? Um, I heard that Wayland is supposed to be frame perfect, to have no tearing. <laughs> and, uh, but someone uh, said, hey, maybe we want some small tearing and people know. So yeah, they, they are uh, fighting because uh, it seems that uh, we, we want to, to have that async thing on Wayland, but not, not everyone agrees. But I don't know, I, I'm not on this war at the moment. And um, and we, we can support that on more drivers. Um, so it's quite easy if your internally your all your legs of things goes to the atomic uh, side. So yeah, if you do that, it's very easy to, to support a sync atomic. And what I learned from all this is that, yes, yeah, maybe your work is just done. It's just about a matter of uh, <laughs> writing four lines of code. And uh, maybe we have more things that were on the legacy DRM API that we left behind and we want to, to have back on the Atomic and maybe it's simpler like that because a lot of machinery of Atomic is uh, being converted. Um, and yeah, I think that's it. Does anyone has any questions, comments? Oh, Daniels? Oh, no, no. Okay, cool. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so Daniel Stone just said that theory is cool and we should we should do that. <laughs> and Wayland is fine having glitz, okay. Uh, any more comments? Questions? Alisa? <laughs> uh, there's one question from the live stream. So thanks for the talk. As a compositor writer, what's the deal with doing atomic mode sets or order updates while in between atomic async page flip submission and completion? Should driver just return EBZ until the flip is done? Yeah, that's... Uh, so the question is... Uh, what between two um sorry uh, let, let's see if i got correct between two um okay between so the question is if between uh submission completion and we try to do a sync uh yeah yeah probably i mean you you should leave as it is you don't want to to mess up because if you are changing proprieties of the the frame between that 
uh, it, it won't work. So probably you, you don't want to, to mess with that and just get it busy. Uh, okay, I think that's it. Thanks.